Hey beauties, welcome back. Thank you to my old and new subscribers. Thank you to every one of you who have supported me this far. I can't thank you guys enough, like you all are amazing. So beauties, in today's video, I'm going to be basically getting ready, okay? So it's just going to be from scratch to finish, like from the beginning to the end, <laughs> if that makes sense. Anyway, from start to finish. So um, that's what I'm be doing. Hopefully this video is not going to be that long, okay? Mm-hmm. So let's get right into it. So guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly, quickly, quickly mask my face, okay? Okay guys, so it's time to take off and I'm using my Bali face wipe. I can't believe these boys are weak already. Seriously. Alright guys, my face is all washed and looking fresh. So, now we're going to get into the business of the day. Bless you son. So now we're going to get into the business of the day, but before we start, I'm going to quickly do my brows off camera and I will be back. Baby, come closer. Yes, guys, you guys are closer to me now. Okay. All right, so my brows are done. So you guys know it's a get ready with me video. So nothing crazy with the eyes. Okay, so keeping it simple. All right, so I'm going into my makeup revolution. This is the regeneration trends mich mischief mischief <laughs> matte palette. Okay, but before I do that, I have to use the LA Girl Pro HD concealer as my base. Okay, so that is done, and yeah. so I'm going into this orange shade right here. Wait, wait. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think I'm going into this shade right here. And it's called the half time. Hey bats. So it's called the half time. I can't really remember where I got these brushes from. The one I'm using right now, but it has a number, number 217, so yeah, that's what I'm using. Okay, I think that looks pretty decent. Alright, so I'm going into this other burnt orange shade right here. And this one is called um, Upper Hand. Okay. I think I'm shouting. I feel like I'm shouting. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I need to get a mic because this sound, this camera sound, like the zooming sound, it's annoying. I need to get a mic so I can always pull it off. Okay. I think this is cool for the eyes. So I'm just going to leave the lid bare, but I'm just blending it out a bit with the remaining on the brush okay, I think it's cool I think it's cool like so mm -hmm. all right so we're going to hold on there and then go do the rest part of the face and come back to the eyes guys you know the drill right you do you do know that all right guys to prime my face I'm using the LA girl pro Prep HD Definition Smoothly Face Primer. Okay, <laughs> that was a long name though. And this one is in clear. Baby, come closer. I think that's, that song is by Whiskey. Mm -hmm. So this is a DIY liquid illuminator that I did. Mm -hmm. I didn't wash it. I'm just going to use it like that. Sorry, guys. 
I need a corrector of course so I'll be using the LA Girl Pro HD orange corrector mm -hmm. so guys for my foundation I'm using the L'Oreal perfect match foundation and this one is in deep cool like guys today I'm using one foundation I'm not mixing okay yeah bro, bro. in your mind you are you're thinking what what mama is doing right Mama is just doing her thing. She's in her world right now. Hmm? Yeah. Yeah. Okay guys, see, I want to ask one question. Am I the only girl who has not figured out her undertone, like her skin undertone? I don't know. I don't know if there's someone like me out there. Okay, because sometimes I see me in red undertone. Sometimes I see me in olive slash golden undertone. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Can someone help me out? All right. So this is it for my foundation, guys. You see what I'm saying? With this foundation, this L'Oreal foundation, I have that olive golden undertone you understand but with the um, um huda beauty foundation i have that red undertone you understand so i don't know and red undertone foundation does look nice on me same with this golden slash olive undertone so i don't know which one to stick to or which one to really call my undertone right shade if that makes sense Anyway, so to highlight, I'm using the Elega Pro Concealer in Toffee. Guys, I'm just going to forward this part because you've seen me do this over and over again. So I don't want to bore you guys. Okay, so to set my highlight, I'm using this powder or this setting powder. It's a chocolate bronzing powder with chocolate dust as well according to the way they wrote it here and it's by I saw a comment yesterday on one of my videos someone was telling me the name of this brand I can't really call it guys though I got it from uh, Roseman okay and it was on that cosmetic or something so yeah but this powder is really 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 nice it's really nice and it complements my skin tone perfectly And it smells really like chocolate. Guys, do you see what I'm talking about? With this powder, I don't have flashback. Not at all. Anyways, so this is it right now. So the next thing I'm going to do is to set the rest part of my face before I do my contour. And I'm doing it with these contour palette of my like my favorite contour palette is by modern fashion yeah i'm taking this shade to set my face and i'm using this shade to contour okay guys there's this recent tricks i learned i don't know if i saw it from anywhere or i just i found myself doing it i don't know so when i'm doing my contour i dab when i dip it into the contour powder i dab it first like so and then gently go ahead and buff it like this you understand buff the edge so, so uh, that way you don't have any harsh line it does work for me guys and that's what i've been doing lately and i love the result so yeah you see so yeah so guys next thing is to use my um bronzer like this bronzer has been my holy grail like things must not be expensive to be your holy grail you get so this powder is like it's doing everything for me and i really really love it though it's on the reddish side but it works perfectly for me so yeah All 
all right guys so the next thing i'm going to do is to spray with my setting spray by manhattan like guys this setting spray is also my holy grail i think it's seven euro or seven euros and some cents i love the way it leaves me with that dewy subtle look and the smell is amazing okay now it's time to do my wingy 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 so i'm going to do that off camera and i'll be back all right guys so my wings are done initially i wasn't going for a dramatic wing but it happened to be so i think it's also okay because there's nothing much going on with the eyes so yeah okay so now i'm going to use my maybelline yeah maybelline mascara in Colossa. So now guys, I'm just going to quickly add my lashes. Alright, so these are my lashes on and so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to quickly take some of those, I think I only used two colors on my lips. So I'm just going to use those same colors to do my under eyes. Guys, can you believe I'm looking for my setting spray cover? I can't find it because Herbert yeah. threw it to somewhere that I can't find it right now. I have to use something else. So I'm going to use this one by Ellie Girl. Anyways, this one I did um, glitter spray right inside. Not really glitter, like illuminator spray. So let me see if this will, you know, if it will work because I haven't used it since I did it. I can't find the other one, the, the cover of this one, Herbert, Herbert. Anyway, so guys, let me just change to my outfit and...